The United States in July 2019 removed Turkey from the F-35 stealth fighter aircraft development and production program. At that time the Turkish government supported buying a Russian air defense missile system that U.S. officials feared could collect sensitive data on the F-35 data that could be utilized by Russia. Reports the national interest. Ankara has agreed to buy as many as 100 F-35 fighters to equip the Air Force and even support to be allocated on new amphibious assault ships. And right now Turkey is looking for new high-tech fighter planes elsewhere. However, it might not include any radar stealth warplanes like the F-35. There are only two stealth aircraft other than the F-35 that are in production and the theory will be available for export markets, namely the Russian Su-57 and the Chinese J-20. However, Chinese buyers are not interested in selling the J-20 outside China for fear that the technology will fall into enemy countries, similar to the F-22 issued in export by the U.S. Parliament. In addition to the Su-57 and J-20, the FC-31 stealth fighter aircraft available in Shenyang, China will be available for export markets. But with slow development progress, it is not possible for Shenyang to accept export orders for J-31. Russian President Vladimir Putin in August 2019 exhibited the Su-57 to President Erdogan during the Russian Mox Air Show. The two leaders started the Su-57, and were involved in discussions about stealth warplanes. But the Su-57 is still under development, and doesn't yet have a main combat system. The su Hoi manufacturer has not yet made a large and efficient production line for this fighter aircraft. And Moscow has almost no money to buy large stealth aircraft. Which means the price per Su-57 unit can be relatively high. In May 2019 Suhoi claims had reduced the price of Su-57 by 20%. The Russian president agreed that the Kremlin in 2027 would buy 76 units of Su-57 instead of just 16, as had been previously supported. I hope the adjusted plan will be executed, Putin said. However, Suhoi will really be able to build 76 Su-57s for Russia. Reject Russia's Su-35 has completed development and has been approved for several customers including Russia and China, Turkey and Russia in September 2019, but the Su-35 is a conventional fighter and has no stealth features. Buy a new fighter now, Turkey might not be able to buy a stealth fighter. Not without reason. Ankara has launched in development of its own anti-radar fighter aircraft, the TFX. Of course TFX faces its own big obstacles. The total cost of US $100 billion for the development, construction and delivery of stealth warplanes, this is in accordance with estimates from the Japanese Air Force Hideyuki Yoshioka, who in 2011 helped restore Japan's own stealth combat program. The F-35 spends around US $10 billion from the United States defense budget of around US $700 billion per year. That's about 1.5%. An affordable, not affordable. Turkey, on the other hand, spends only US $20 billion each year on its armed forces. Try to compare with support providing a budget of US $100 billion for stealth combat programs. All things considered, the Su-35 can be launched into the next Turkish fighter. And that could take a long time before Turkey follows up on a Su-35 with a stealth fighter.